uh, last week, comedian Joy Behar uh, delivered a um, a roast of uh, Chris Christie at an event that was supposed to be a uh, roast uh, of the former governor of New Jersey. And um, she spent her time taking shots at Christie, who was sitting right next to her. And you should see the video because he is not laughing. I mean, he's, a, you know, he's another progressive bully. And um, um, he's not laughing. And she just takes a really just bad, stupid, you know, Joy Behar jokes. Um, and just, uh, and... Um, She's the, 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 the governor is just staring at her and uh, she says, stop bullying me. And uh, she said, then, then, then she actually says, why don't you get up here uh, at the microphone instead of being such a coward? Mm. Really? If there's one thing about Chris Christie. He's not a coward. And uh, so he did get up to the microphone and he said, really, this is what you were thinking. At least I don't get paid for this. And she said, who would pay you for this? And he said, wow, that's the same thing I was thinking about you. <laughs> it's an ugly, ugly exchange. Awkward. Very awkward. And Joy Behar just looks bad as usual. And it was just, it was a roast on somebody else, Somebody else. Right? It wasn't supposed to be on her. I mean, on, on him. Yeah. And uh, so you got that, you, you got that going for you. You got that going for you. She's terrific. No, she is. Terrific. <laughs> Don't you miss her on The View and her show that lasted 15 minutes and oh, got she's canceled? Oh, she's not on there anymore? No. Which one of the shows that lasted 15 minutes? She's had several. I don't even, I don't know the names of any of them. I mean, it's not bad to have a show that lasts 15 minutes. You know, everybody could fail once. Sure. You know what I mean? But even twice, fail a couple of times. Over and over and over, over, and over, and over again, again. It just gets to be yeah. a little, it gets to be, become predictable and... Mm-hmm fatiguing for the... Didn't she say the last time that she would be working on her comedy routine and stuff? In the Catskills? Yeah. she's. I think she's I'm still pretty... in the Catskills uh, doing her com- comedy routine, isn't she, with Phyllis yeah. Diller? She and Phyllis, I think, uh, <laughs> nightly. Uh, she said that uh, she, when she first read about... Uh, you get ready for this. You ready for this? When she first read that uh, uh, Chris Christie was uh, blocking off lanes of traffic on the bridge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. yeah. What did right? she think the first time she, she heard she, that? She was wondering, what, is he just standing in the middle of the bridge? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no, take my wife, please. Oh. <laughs> it's really, it's not worth, it's not worth doing unless you have, like, you could hear the, like, the clinking of glasses. <laughs> And the people eating and still kind of talking and stuff, and you hear the you know the ice in the glass. That's that's when you know you've got a Joy Behar. The person <laughs> asking for mayonnaise yeah, too and, close to the microphone. Yeah, no. <laughs> Waitress, can we get some more to drink here? How much longer is this gonna last? <laughs> I haven't. I, this is the first time I've had a drink, but I can't take any more of this. Waitress. <laughs> That's what you hear in the back of mm-hmm. all J- Joey Behar things. It's uh... <laughs> She's good, though. When is Phyllis Diller come on? <laughs> it's really, I mean, we should really stop with that because this is an insult to Phyllis Diller. It is. Yeah, it is. Not. I apologize. Wait a minute. That's not Phyllis Diller? <laughs> <laughs> Phyllis is still alive, right? She's alive. Uh, well, uh, I think she is. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, I will say it's um, an, interest, an interesting approach, is how I would put it, for uh, Joy Behar to criticize someone's appearance. Yeah. It's an it interesting approach. Don't know if it's advisable mm-hmm. for her to do, but it's an interesting approach. Are you saying that she's mm-hmm. a hideous mm-hmm. Gila monster? Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Is that what you're saying? Mm-hmm. I, I said it in a longer more polite way but yes that right. that was what i was going for i'm not saying that about her but that's what you I, were just wondering saying. if he was saying that yeah because yes. i would be disappointed and i, and if I, you and I was her. saying it but i was saying it in a more polite way uh-huh mm-hmm. okay. i really feel bad for her i really do because at some point she is going to be in her 600 square foot apartment mm-hmm. uh, she's me i mean look, people topple f- over forked cash over to her for she'll have forgotten time. her life alert button and uh, her cats will eat her. Cats will eat her because there won't be anybody. Mm-hmm. There won't be any friends around. And she has what seventeen cats? Twenty. Well, it's, it's in, the 20 it's which, in which room? In the living room. You know she's a cat person. You know she just reeks of a cat person. Or 
And multiple or, cats. There's nothing wrong with having one cat. Ugh, or she's a very, very, one of those very small dog people. Nothing wrong with having a small Nothing dog. wrong with having small dogs. Nothing wrong. Nothing wrong with it. I'd say you should not cast asparagus on my character uh, as, as a man who has two small dogs. And Pat, uh, the asparagus you're casting on him as he has one, one small, small dog. dog. Mm-hmm. Well, but at least if you have a small dog, you don't have like uh, you don't have purses in your gun safe, do you? Uh, I mean, I there are no. purses in a I safe that don't. could also hold guns. Mm-hmm. Okay, so. It's a versatile safe. Right, we got to stop talking say. before I have to fire both of you. 